good morning children as you know that i had already shared a presentation of coal and petroleum with you all and an explanatory video for chapter 5 also here in this presentation i'll show you how you have to write in your class for copies okay so you have to start uh, you have to put the heading chapter 5 coal and petroleum the first heading would be natural resources what are natural resources as all of you know we have already studied that natural resources are the resources we get from nature like air water sunlight soil etc here are some pictures also children you don't have to draw these pictures they are just for understanding and then you'll write the types of natural resources you can make a flow chart that uh, you can draw a flow chart and uh, write that there are two types of natural resources in inexhaustible natural resources and exhaustible natural resources and then you have to define you have to give the examples of exhaustible and non exhaustible substances and then you have to write about fossil fuels what are fossil fuels which are formed from the dead remains of living organisms that lived millions of years ago and the examples are coal petroleum and natural gas these all we have discussed children there are some pictures you don't need to draw the pictures okay and then uh, this is about coal the story of the coal uh, it's already there in explanatory video coal was formed by the burial of forest under the soil due to earthquakes landslides or flooding so here you have to write the process of the slow process of conversion of dead plants into coal okay here also no need to draw any kind of diagrams and then uh, we had studied about uh, useful products from coal we studied about three uh, useful products coke coal tar and coal gas so here is the explanation given for all the three you can write neatly in your copies and then the next fossil fuel that is petroleum petroleum was formed from the organisms living in the sea as these organisms died their bodies got settled at the bottom of the sea and got covered by the layers of sand and clay and you know children that due to high temperature and pressure it got converted into petroleum and natural gas but it took millions of years for this slow process and then we studied about refining of petroleum you have to write what is refining of petroleum petroleum is uh, made up of various constituents so we need to separate all those constituents so they so that they can be used for various purposes so uh, what is refining of petroleum you have to write it in your copy and then uh, you can make this diagram children uh, various constituents of petroleum and their uses uh you can draw this diagram and you can write about various constituents and their uses a table is also there in the book you can refer your book or uh, you can just see from the presentation itself then uh, the last part was natural gas natural gas is easy to transport through pipes and it is stored under high pressure as cng or compressed natural gas and uh, these are the various uses shown here in the picture don't uh, draw the pictures they are just for understanding uh, it's a very clean fuel natural gas is a very clean fuel and it is less polluting okay so this was the last slide children so uh, i'm giving you today uh, you can write uh, all these notes in your copies and yet then you can share the picture of your work also in class work copy okay children uh and presentation is also there this is just for understanding a video was made uh, you are having presentation i shared it yesterday so refer to the presentation and prepare very good notes in your class work copies okay children have a good day